we want a real fix, not a sh short short term fix. Quick fix isn't going to work right now. That uh, w critical to us is Greece's debt sustainability. Uh, that means that by 2020, we want to see Greece's debt at 120 percent of its gross domestic product. That's where it stands. To fix Greece, to get Greece back on a path of growth and job creation, because that's ultimately, you know, it's not all about fiscal policy, it's about getting back to growth and job creation. Uh, to get there, you have to lower its debt to GDP ratio uh, uh, in a significant way, and you've got to assure that it's around 120 percent of GDP by 2020. Uh, we've, we've just made clear that Greece, for the point we want to make is that it is not all about austerity. It is about getting back to growth and to job creation. Um, many sacrifices have to be made and are being made by people throughout Europe, and we're very well aware of that. But that's why it's important to act expeditiously, not just on fiscal policies, but on structural reforms and other important mechanisms that are going to help position Europe, a number of the countries mentioned here, position Europe for stronger growth and job creation uh, over time. Job creation, because that's ultimately, you know, it's not all. A significant development is the fact that the discussions have now been initiated. Uh, that, that, is, that is heartening. Uh, but the bottom line is, is that action has to be taken. If there is no action, and that means everybody, that's on both, all sides of the equation, have to be ready to uh, deal with uh, the fiscal cliff, the debt ceiling. If it is not dealt with, uh, we are talking about zero to negative growth in the United States. And the spillover effects of that could be, global spillover effects, that could be very significant. So this is a significant uh, challenge, both politically and economically, and our messages deal with it expeditiously.